Hey there, Aquarius. As you know, the Emerald Sorceress here. Let's play cards. Alright, let's see what's going on for Aquarius. Let's see. Ugh. I don't feel like doing my hair, so it's a hat day. The point is getting the message out, the truth. So maybe there's some message you gotta get out here. Don't forget to like, subscribe, thumbs up, so the video can circulate, please, and thank you, thank you. Um, I do feel like there's like some lack of intimacy here, uh, an inability to be creative. Something is not going well, or as planned, that's for sure. Ooh. Door to personal healing and happiness. Some new beginning. If you're trying to manifest a new beginning. Ooh. But you're manifesting out of a, a low vibration here. Yeah. There's a lot of grief and stress. Some dark energies that are keeping you stuck. Peace. You need to make peace with something. Be at peace with someone. Some situation. Something like that. definitely need some healing here uh, and some change change in the wind having to do with a partnership you feel orphaned by something by someone here maybe you feel unappreciated or we will see Pentacles. Something that you're invested in, Eight of Swords, has got you stuck. Something you've spent time on, money on, put effort into. You've groomed it. You've tried to grow it here. Grow it. Ten of Pentacles. Feel a legacy, a legacy, a future. Uh, create some sort of foundation with someone. All right, what is this? What is this lack of creativity and... Um, Queen of Wands is always out for you. All right. Woosa. All of a sudden, I'm like anxious. What is behind there? All right, what is this here? The second chakra, which is probably blocked here, along with the heart chakra. All right. Lack of creativity. The sun. Leo. What's this? Ace of Swords. There's something you need to see here. Divine Masculine needs to see something. Aquarius, you need to be honest. And I think mostly it's with yourself here. About lovers, about some partnership, maybe a marriage here. Five of Swords. Um, where you're still guarded or you're still, I don't know. Your love is someplace else. <clears throat> you feel blocked from love. Blocked from peace. Hangman. Just stuck. The Page of Pentacles. I mean the Page of Cups. Seven of Swords. Eight of Cups. Someone's gone. Knight of Swords. Which is left to you and the Eight of Swords here. Because seven and one is eight nine even like more stress grief you think about this person all the time here it's getting in your away emotionally someone like packed their bags and they were gone maybe you feel like you didn't get a chance to apologize or reconcile or share your true feelings what is this door to personal healing and happiness new beginning hangman king of wands that's like the inability to take action. Three of Cups. Maybe somebody got friend zoned. Can I have another one? Maybe you're hoping somebody will have a change in perspective here. Tower. Eight 
Eight of Wands. Something about traveling and a messenger. Eight of Swords. Eight, eight. Being practical, taking a practical approach to things. So maybe you like know you're blocked, like, but you just don't know how to get out of your way here. Queen of Pentacles. You can't let go of this person. Wheel of Fortune. Six of Swords. But they have already they moved away. Or you have moved away. Somebody left alone too here. There's nobody else in that boat. This is karma. What is this here? And it definitely was 1111. Somebody could have lost a home, a partner, uh, their freedom, a reason, like a zest for life, a reason to celebrate. What is this broken heart? Heartbroken over a karmic contract here going to be a theme for today <clears throat> the chariot some yin and yang thing uh did not work out it broke apart here nine of cups could have to do with somebody being selfish or lazy or addictions can i have another one a hierophant somebody had a hard time doing the right thing Somebody is burdened about some partnership, and I just saw the devil and the king of pentacles. This definitely could have been a marriage. It was definitely a soul contract. Ten of pentacles. Woulda, coulda, shoulda, I feel like. The moon. Fear and ego with the sun and the moon, and also yin and yang with the sun and the moon here. Somebody with somebody's everything. What is this piece over here? magician and the five of swords that's not peaceful ten of swords wow empress and emperor ace of pentacles uh, freedom from attachment or radical acceptance it's time to accept something accept some ending maybe even stop fighting with yourself here or you're fighting yourself to take some sort of action because the magician is an action card. Or again, manifesting at a low vibration here. That's why you can't find peace. Five of wands, exactly. Nine of wands, you're definitely guarded. six of cups like you didn't want something to come to a completion in the world you didn't want some separation you don't want some separation some sort of competition here there's two of pentacles exactly an imbalance yes yeah, somebody is definitely wishy-washy one foot in one foot out somebody maybe not emotionally <clears throat> developed here One foot in, one foot out. Analysis, paralysis, a draining life source. You can't stop obsessing about it. Or someone can't stop obsessing about the situation. All right, tell me more about Aquarius here, please. What is this lack of love and creativity? And ooh. Somebody could have got a warning here. There was definitely a detour. Somebody had gotten their boat, plotted a course of action. Somebody could live near the ocean here, the Hierophant. Somebody removed unwanted stuff, purging. This uh, seemed to be unavoidable. Ball and chain, death. Unhappily married, breakup, devil, partner. A catalyst. All right, next, what's this door to personal healing and happiness? Someone's leaving. Playing the field right there. Oh, and then there's a marriage and communication. Um, the Milky Way and the Ladybug. So, and the chariot again. 
it was like this vibrant, happy life thing going on here, but somebody couldn't see it. Somebody's watching somebody's social media here. Something got exposed, put everything into a different perspective here. The Wheel of Fortune or Jupiter. Again, Jupiter's your ruling planet. And Pluto. A clean slate, fundamental changes, and more clearing and purging. It's like everything got tossed out. 11-11. Somebody didn't heed the call. Time. Aquarius. Something was unstoppable here. You couldn't stop it or it was too late because there was already something wrong. And again, somebody just like took off stealth fast. All right, tell me about this contract that with the broken heart here. What is this? Tell me more. Jupiter. Things breaking down to make something else, but even more than that, it's probably magic. And more peace. Short-lived destiny, a turning point. Somebody had to make some sort of stable changes and find a way to grow or make something grow here. Something about tolerant. Someone could only like take so much here. Justice, Libra, right and wrong. Yeah, again, karma, karmic. Somebody is very artistic here. Desires, harmony, and balance. Another 11. The Fire Fi. Somebody very exceptional here. The end. And the sun again. It's like somebody got some clarity a little too late. There was a climax or somebody was stuck in their ego here. Aquarius. Aquarius and Libra. All right. Somebody's definitely watching someone. There was some sort of documents here. What's all these fives at the end with the peace? Can't get no peace. The fool. Somebody is a free spirit. Solo, isolation, estrangement, separation, catalyst, the bellows breaking free, efforts required, pride and ego, yeah, projection, looking closer in, uh, at the past here, uh, looks like you want to contact someone about love and reconciliation and a road trip here. Je ne sais quoi. I don't know. There's still some stalemate. Delay tactics. Temperance. Something spontaneously. A new perspective here. And then you got two kids out here. A few children. Alright, let's see. with business a labyrinth savage wild animal a jeep somebody could drive a jeep here somebody like went on attack pride and ego here and then it got all confusing and then it's gonna get all confusing dire predictions a villain I told you it's like some other woman around, too, witnessing a crime. And unexpected help. It's like somebody had, like, all their prayers answered. There's some, like, angel around. Here we go with, like, a storyteller here. A computer, a plot. And then... 
everything just kind of goes left. Killer. Exactly. Plot twist. Soul. Karma. It's all about karma, spiritualism, and magic. Somebody tried to resuscitate something. He has definitely some sort of angel or angelic being around a home. This all has to do with a home and maybe some domestic violence or family squabbles here. Life. I don't know. Libra, uh, her, that, that the ooh, game of life here. It's like been some sort of like reincarnation to put the people here to learn some things somebody who's endangered maybe i don't know there's aliens popping up everywhere to find your way home again with a road trip i don't know what's up with that here but there's somebody definitely took off secret life something about a police station watching videos listening to music overcome addiction and more children Something about a past. The past here is just like you can't get over it. Or you're still participating in it and you shouldn't be smoking mirrors, ears wide open, but it's a fox here, a fairy tale. Yeah, they don't always have great endings, but I do feel like there's all these great things in your life and some of you went fucked it up. Pretty much. Body and soul going beyond the normal. Bring into form. You're definitely trying to manifest a person, a vibe, an energy that you miss. You, body and soul, I feel like it's empty and you're really trying to dig down deep to send out the messages to the universe and you're hoping that Jupiter is listening here. What is that? A bat having to do with some renewal there's definitely like mischief in the fog there was just something not right call on the voices that stir your senses through the night cast an unforgiven howl as you stomp your might through the ground so the forest could be very important to you yeah but you're definitely like trying to get your point across to the universe it's like you're screaming quiet mind power of purpose you're really trying to get your uh point across here feeling the world you want the world to feel you to know that you want something you're definitely trying to release old patterns here beautiful uncaging so there's definitely some heart healing. You need to trust yourself, trust your noses, forgive yourself here. Somebody is definitely a witch. Greet the darkness, embrace all the, all the bad things with you, the good and the bad. Probably need to find a place to sit in silence here. Crystals, herbs, and healing. Spirituality is very important. An altar beyond the ordinary because you are beyond the ordinary. Restore and replenish. Don't let yesterday take up too much of today. I'm going to leave you there. Bye.